Welcome everybody to this Halloween themed video. We have been delving into the Golf Clash Crypts and we are going to look at some of the creepiest bulls that we have had on sale within Golf Clash over the years. Before we get started, don't forget to hit thumbs up on the video and make sure you are subbed to the channel as well. Get ready to type in the comment section down below. I want to know if you've got every single one of the balls that I'm going to put up on screen and let me know which ones were your favourites. In no particular order, as they do like to say, let's start with the Dreaded Dunes bundle. This uh, was the Scarab ball here that you can see, wind one, power five, side spin three. And that one was bundled in with the Anubis ball, which is uh, that one there, very, very pretty designs. And as you can see, Dreaded Dunes bundle for that one. We had the Black Widow Ball, may not have been a Halloween release, but still a creepy looking ball and worthy of mention here. Power 5 with side spin 2, but wind resistance 2, so very useful if you wanted to just knock down the wind a bit from a berserker. The Skull Ball, which now we know is a dead ball. I remember when these used to be really good balls, and in, indeed they still are very good, but with the stats you get nowadays, uh, they're actually not that exciting, but at the time, very, very good indeed. Very nice if you could win some of these. The eyeball there is another classic uh, power five, sorry, power one, wind five. Uh, real uh, good classic stalwart par three ball in the game. Then we had here a backspin boost job. Backspin boost five with the gargoyle ball. I don't think I bought any of these uh, for some reason. But nice looking one anyway. The ghost ball I do remember. That was the first premium ball I ever remember buying in the game. Back when I didn't really know much about the game. But uh, for some reason I decided to get some. And I think I've still got some left. However, difficulty there was centering the thing in the adjustment ring. Due to the, uh, the cap that the uh, ghost is wearing if I remember. We have here another creepy bundle. The mean green and the gator ball bundle. There you see the gator ball again. It's uh, this what time though, it is power five, wind resistance one, but you just get a little bit more side spin. If ever you wanted a bit more side spin on your berserker, that was the ball for you. And then the mean green ball, uh, wind five, side spin five, power zero. Both of those though, especially the mean green, again, not totally round. So if you do have difficulty centering in the adjustment ring, maybe that bundle was not for you. The Mummy Ball is another classic. How about that? Wind 4, side spin 1, power 3. Then we had, of course, the reskinned Kingmaker, also known as the Pumpkin Ball. I think I've got one left on my main account, which, of course, I'm not using. I'm just going to keep it there. But uh, there we go, a little creepy version of the Kingmaker. The Serpent Ball. I think this was a pretty good one. It did have a bit of motion to it as well. I think the uh, snakes did kind of writhe around a little bit from what I can remember. Uh, wind 2, side spin 3, power 4. And another classic here, one of the older ones, the spider ball. Wind 4, side spin 2, power 1. I do remember having these for quite a while. I don't think I found much use for them, sadly. Now the next one is going to hurt a little bit for me. The Spirit Ball, the best ball that I never bought, and I regret the decision not to buy any to this day. What a fantastic ball, and I know at the time a lot of people passed these up because they thought it was gimmicky with the top spin boost 5 and wind resistance 0, but then all these great shots came out, particularly in Master, people easily reaching the green on tricky par 5s, and uh, I often regret not buying any of these. Nothing has come uh, exactly to match this yet. We've been close. There's been a few close ones there, but definitely not as uh, spooky looking or as useful as the Spirit Ball. So I do regret that one. And here we have the Werewolf Ball. This was a favourite of mine. Great stats on this one. and I did enjoy uh, getting some of these and also winning them as well. Power 4, Side Spin 1 and Wind Resistance 4. Very useful stats on the Werewolf Ball. Before we uh, wrap up this video, don't forget we do have the golden shot feature that we have had in the game uh, definitely for the last four years with different ball prizes. So if we are going to see a Halloween version this year, it would be very, very nice indeed. 
We have in the past been able to win the pumpkin balls, the eyeballs, mummy balls, spider balls, werewolf and serpent balls in the golden shot. So it does add a little bit of variety to the usual format for Halloween. I do hope that they are going to do something similar this year. Let me know in the comments section what you would like to see in future for Halloween themed balls and which ones were your favourites. And we will see you all very soon. Cheers, bye for now.